Hi guys, some of you may be wondering, is it possible for me to improve the sound of my TV without spending hundreds or even thousands of dollars on the sound system? Well, if you have a portable speaker lying around, it's definitely possible to do so and I'm going to show you how. Okay, first of all, you're going to need a portable speaker. And this is a portable speaker from Sony called the HearGo. Okay, so very importantly, look at the back of the speaker and find this little pin hole here called audio in. Now, if it looks like this, this is called a 3.5 millimeter audio jack. You will need an input like this for you to connect any external device to your speaker. Okay, so make sure you have, that you have this input first on your portable speaker. Okay, so the next thing you're gonna need is a mini input jack cable. Uh, you can get this at uh, just about most hardware stores would have this. I got this one from Newstead. You can also find it at Challenger. I tried looking for it at HomeFix, but it seems that they don't have any more of these audio cables. So, and they come in different lengths. I've got a 1.8 meter one, which costs about uh, six to seven dollars. You may get it in lengths like uh, two meters or even three meters, depending on how far away your TV do you want to put your speaker. 1.8 meters, enough for most applications. Now I'm just going to remove the packet here. With one hand, okay. Right, so this is what it looks like. It should have only two lines, two lines, not one, not three, but two. Okay, so this is to represent that this is a stereo cable for two channel audio. Now I'm just going to turn to the back of the speaker here like this. Okay, and notice that here it plugs right in like that okay now we're gonna go and do the same thing with the TV okay so what I'm gonna need you to do next is to find this label at the back of the TV called an audio out sometimes it may be labeled as headphone out but they do the same thing the output audio from your TV to an external device like a pair of headphones or a speaker and the cable that you're gonna use here is a 3.5 millimeter jack as well Okay, like this. So if it looks like the port at the back of your portable speaker, this is the right port to use. I'm just gonna go ahead and plug it right in like this. Okay. Just make sure that I'm getting the right port. Okay, this. Okay, so I've got it in. Right, okay, so I'm just gonna go back to the speaker and we'll see if it works. Okay, so the TV has been hooked up to the speaker using an audio jack wire. Now, we simply have to make sure that the speaker is switched on like this and to always make sure that it's put into auxiliary mode or audio in mode. Okay, if you don't have this lighted up, it's not gonna work, trust me. So you need to switch it into audio in mode or auxiliary mode. Okay, and next, just feel free to raise the volume like this and we're just going to play a video right now to make sure that it works. Okay, so I'm just going to press play. The 19, hit Monchan. Put up your dukes and square off against this fighting type Pokemon, if you can find him. Whether or not you'll ever stumble across this quick... Okay, so it works. Well, this is how you connect your speaker up to a TV and this will work for any TV as long as it has a headphone jack and for any speaker as long as it has an audio input jack like the one I've just showed you. If you have any questions regarding connections and stuff like that, please feel free to comment below and I'll answer them as soon as I can. Now, if you will excuse me, I have to go back to playing Pokemon Go. See ya!